Hello everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel. This is Khalid Mahmood, your online trainer. Do you want to improve your AutoCAD 2D skill with real practice? In today's video, we will draw this exercise 49 step by step in AutoCAD using just a simple tool, clear logic and clean techniques. So perfect for beginners and engineering student. And yes, the project file is available in the description so you can download and practice along with me so let's get started step one set drawing unit and limits first thing let's set up the drawing environment type un open the unit dialog box and keep the unit in millimeter here is a millimeter press ok now step two Draw the base rectangle. As you see in this diagram, this one is our base rectangle. We are going to create. Use the rectangle command and click specific point and choose as a dimension 2084. So just activate rectangle using REC, press enter. Click on first point and D for dimension 20, enter 84, enter. Just put it left, right, anywhere. Okay. Now, step three add center and all the circles. So, let's draw the two main circles at the center. So, this one our main circle. After this one, we are going to create this circle and this circle. Use the circle command, activate using C, enter, pick the center point and set as a radius as per the drawing so just click here and put it radius will be 8 press enter and again radius will be 50 press enter now select both circle move using m enter downside it will be 30 press enter now create a second circle these circles okay so inner circle radius will be 10 and outer circle radius will be 20 okay so now we are going to create it here so choose as a circle using c enter click on this midpoint and put a value as a inner circle 10 and as a outer circle 20 select both circle just move it right side using m enter right side it will be 45 press enter again choose m for move command p for previous selection enter and downside it will be 12 press enter now need to create this circle okay so this inner circle radius will be 10 okay and the outer circle radius will be 14 so activate circle command using c enter click on this midpoint and put a value as a radius 10 press enter now select this circle using m for move right side it will be 45 press enter now again create one more circle these outer circle its radius will be 14 okay 1 4 14 so just create using c enter click on same center point and put a value as a radius 14 yeah you can choose this circle as a radius 8 so just right click and go to properties and put a value of this radius it will be 8 press enter now close this one now need to create these curves and these curves and also these curves so step 4 create side cutouts and curves so let's move to the side ox or cutout these looks are just like a semicircle so use our command yeah you can use circle command but i prefer you can use fillet command okay for this one we are going to create fillet command and for this one we are going to using line command but before create this ox we need to create 
these lines so from here to here line distance from here to here offset will be 20 so we are going to create this one so select this rectangle using x for explode using o for offset put a value as a 20 click this line and put it here now we need to create these curves so first we need to activate fillet command f for fillet r for radius a radius value will be 12 m for multiple because of we are going to create multiple times select this circle to this line sm as select this line to this circle now we need to add this line so you can activate tangent command using o s enter d select clear all and choose only tangent command press ok now activate line l for line click on this circle to this circle again this circle to this circle okay now o s for o snap setting select all press ok select all these parts and also this one deselect this one using mi for mirror command and put it this midpoint to midpoint choose as a no now create the last arc this one okay then radius value will be 74 so you can use our command but i prefer you can go with the circle command using c enter ttr for tangent tangent radius press enter first this circle second this circle and put a value 74 press enter now step 5 add fillet and clean the corners so you can use trim command to clean up the corners using tr enter enter trim this one this one this one and this one also this one this one and select this circle using e for erase tr double enter trim this one and just zoom in and trim this also this one okay now step six final detail and clean up now let's add the final internal lines dimension okay use line offset trim and build the internal structure as show select all the diagram except the center line go to properties and add a line thickness as a 0 0.30 now step add dimension if you would like you can add dimension using dim command this helps in understanding measurement especially if you are practicing for a real world project or assignment so that's all you have successfully completed autocad practice exercise 49 step by step download the project file from the description and practice on your if you found this video helpful give it a like and subscribe to our youtube channel for more exercises and click join to support the channel and unlock exclusive content so thank you thanks for watching keep practicing keep growing see you in the next video tata bye bye take care